she is parched. She is parched and this is going to be a long haul. Hey guys, what's up? My name's Hope. I'm a full-time nurse and a part-time reseller. I save lives, I save clothes, I save all the things. Thumbs up for that. So we are going way back in time <laughs> to my birthday haul because it's just been sitting here. I've listed about half of it, but that's about it. And it's time to, yeah, finally get it filmed. It's going to be long another long haul. I'm back! So I hope you uh, can get some work done while I'm sharing with you all my fun finds for my birthday. And yeah, we're just gonna crack right into it. First, I gotta give a shout out to Sydney, chick by the truckload, chick? Chic by the truckload on whatnot. I got my Guns N' Roses tee, got my Madewell little uh, midi skirt to go with it right here. Did some little sourcing for my myself, a cute little outfit. It's a little Madewell button front pocket midi skirt my little t-shirt love it so much so you get really good deals on there sourcing wise but i got that for myself happy belated birthday hope <laughs> okay so we'll start with like tiny stuff okay so i got this um this is savage x fenty it is a lace little bralette Super cute. I think that's inside out. That definitely is inside out. It's way cuter than that in real life. I'm killing myself with cutting off my head all the time in all my haul videos. Black little lace. It is new with tags and it is size 1X. I'm not sure what that means, but it's a size 1X. So this is just a little Urban Outfitters ribbed button front cardigan. It's navy and white just like the classic ribbed tight fitting like a little schoolgirl cardigan i got that that is like super cute with like tucked into like a midi skirt it's a vibe <laughs> so then i got this Casabella, made in italy size medium these brawls retail for like 70 something dollars i found the stock photo of this yeah, seems unassuming, but if you find this brand, Cosabella, it's good. So, get it. I haven't listed that yet. If it's listed, I'll tell you. I got this for my kid, but then decided I've given her enough. <laughs> Size medium. It's Billie Eilish. It's the black crew neck with the Billie Eilish lime green graphic. It's from H&M. I'm just kidding. I'm probably going to give it to her. She wanted this, and I was like, no. This is Zara, but this is Zara Man. Zara X Toy Story Disney. This has got, got ham all over it, the pig. This is a man crew neck. Size. This is a men's size small. I, the stock photo is so cute. I could get probably 25 30 for that. Not, It's not listed. Then I had never heard of this Osaka 6 plus Super Dry Project. So I picked it up. I don't do men's. But comps look like 25 on this t-shirt. This is like brand new. Never been worn. It's also men's. Size 2XL is what it says. It doesn't look like it's that big. But here's a fun one. This is a spirit jersey. This is like a guaranteed 40-ish dollars. Some of them do really good, but this one's kind of plain Walt Disney World. But it is in that pretty mint green. I haven't looked it over. I feel like, yeah, there are like a few little faint little spots, but I'll just wash it. It's in like really good condition. It doesn't feel like it's ever been like washed and dried a lot. Well, this don't tell you how long ago this haul was. I got this because I was like, oh, this would be perfect to list for like a little Sailor July 4th outfit. It's express size medium. Usually I wouldn't pick this up, but I feel like it was like two bucks or something. But it's like a little open front uh, blazer, but it's like cotton. Has like the cuffed. Has little pockets. Yeah, it's just like an open front red and blue. That would have been so cute for 4th of July, but that's come and gone. So, that'll just live in my death pile for the next year. <laughs> this is Betsy Johnson Performance, size small. It's new with tag. Uh, 
$60 tank top. This is like light. This is, you can't even tell how vivid orange this is because my lights are really blowing it out. But it's like neon orange. Perforated. It zips in the front. Cute little workout tank. Alright. These, I'm just going to lot these together. I don't know if I'm going to lot them for posh or for, um, what not. But this is a Lane Bryant. It's called the Swing Collection. New with tag, size 2224. Yeah, so it's just like this little classic little black swing top, plus size, new with tag, and then this is the same thing, size 2224 Lane Bryant. And it's like a really thin knit short sleeve little open cardigan like a little cover up like a bolero almost yeah just like that kind of like a waffle knit very lightweight so not too heavy I'm gonna put those together and sell them together okay now where do we go we go to shoes all right I got these dance goes these are like a reptile print <laughs> fell forward a reptile print um these are a size 39 yeah it's like an iridescent snake they're in such good condition I could not leave them so we got those those are listed I don't remember for how much but they are listed I just can't seem to sit down <laughs> And so it's like really messing with my haul videos. Like I used to have it set up where I sat and filmed and my camera was at a different angle. And now everything's all messed up. So until I figure it all back out again. Yeah, this is where we're at. These are Dolce Vita. The real Dolce Vita. These are called the Shayla. They're a seven and a half. It's like this gray taupe nude leather upper. It's an espadrille wedge. Like, fabulous condition. So this is not the Target line. This is the more expensive line. I need to get those listed because it's almost time for those not to be in season. These are Fly London. I knew as soon as I seen this. I was like, yay! Fly London. Can you see the fly in the London? These have like a leopard print inside. They're a brown suede little booty in pretty darn good condition like the bottoms look fantastic they have the little fly on the side there the suede you know it just needs brushed but they are a size 38 I love finding Floy London oh these are so good Tory Burch I had these listed for like a hundred I think these are a seven and a half. That's my size. I tried them on. They are too tight. So these run small. Um, yeah, my toes feel crunched and I'm a true seven and a half, but I do have long toes. So maybe that's why I feel like a seven would be perfect. But yeah, these are in fabulous condition. Like they're flawless. I think they retail for like $200. So I have them listed at 100. We'll see how they do. I got these Echoes. I don't have these listed yet. These are the Hydromax. I don't know if these are like a... I don't know what these are. But I thought they were, you know, cool. Echo. They're a size 37. But they have this weird... Are these for golf? Maybe they're for golf. I have to do more research. But they're in such fabulous condition that I couldn't leave them. Like, they're, like, brand new. So, we got those. I just don't know what they are. <laughs> uh, next are these Sam Edelman boots. Oh, I love these so much. These are a size 10. I wish these were my size. These are the Carolina. Ugh. These are, like, what punk rocker chic is made of. They're a, just, like, a lace-up chunky chunky big chunky heel and it has like this metallic across the back all leather suede oh my gosh these are fabulous like new size 10 i haven't looked up comps on these but i know it's going to be great because yeah 
Those are fabulous. These are bag... Bag... <laughs> I can't say it. Badgley... Badgley Mishka. Look at those. Uh, these are a party in a shoe. They're brand new. They had the little tag on them here, but I peeled it and then it kind of peeled a little bit of the shoe with it. But they're a glitter platform. It's like a little stripper heel. Go girl. Get it. Um, they're a size seven and a half. That's my size. Should I do a little dance? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> That's a negative. Anyways, bag Badgerly Mishka. New little glitter shoes. Of course, I'll buy those. I don't know what the comps are on that brand, but I, I knew the name, so I bought it. This is the cutest... Let me tell you the brand of this. Montserrat de Luca. I'll show you the tag. Montserrat. Oh, can you see it? I don't, it's not gonna, it has no idea where to look. It's just trying to find me. That did not work. <laughs> that did not go as planned. Anyways, Montserrat de Luca. I have no idea, but look at this bag. How cute is this? It's this straw crossbody, or it can be carried like this. And it has the gold woven throughout, like the metallic gold. Perfect little circle bag. And you can wear it crossbody. It's it's a summer moment. So that's cute. Here are these are Cork E's. I've never found this brand before. I was thrilled. These aren't probably aren't the, the best Cork E's that you could ever find, but I found them. They have this blue. And that came like that, which is weird, but okay. <laughs> uh, they're gray with this blue here and here. No idea, you guys. I've literally never found this brand, but I was very excited to. They're a 10 slash 42, so that's a great size. Cork E, so K-O-R-K dash E, E-A-S-E. So, yeah. I, I've heard... Nothing but good things about this brand, and this is a size 10. So I think I gotta do research. I haven't done research. Okay. Also, there's an honorable honorable mention for two things that were in this haul that I already sold. I found these platform Crocs, like they were like this high. Those sold for like twenty dollars in like a day, and I was like, gosh darn it, I haven't filmed my haul video yet. And then there was something else. Oh, a Rails blush. It was like a pink and white plaid flannel rails and that sold for $35 in literally seconds and I was like oh darn I priced that too low <laughs> it's I mean within seconds they didn't even send me an offer they just bought it outright I listed it at 35 so anyways those things sold but they were they were part of the haul too um this is J Crew size small I got this ballet core number one number two because I've already sold it just a gray like stretchy sweater knit with the pink tulle ruffle at the bottom at the hem little peplum tooled ruffle hem I've sold this exact sweater before 25 I think 20 or 25 so when I seen it I was like oh that's an that's easy I know that sells and I've already sold it before so yeah so that's listed this is Victor Costa a size 10. This is a beautiful, beautiful lace, like romantic vintage lace, like almost like a corset blouse because of the way it has those hook and loop. Um, so much detail. Oh my gosh. It's just absolutely stunning. The only problem is, is to see these little black strings here. It had a black, it's supposed to have a black satin ribbon that you tie at the waist. And mine is missing, but that's a super easy, easy fix. This is in like beautiful condition. All you have to do is get a ribbon and then you can tie it around your waist and you can get any ribbon color you choose. This is Zach Posen for Target. That Victor Costa blouse is listed. That's Zach Posen for Target. Size medium. The stock photo on this is so adorable. It's like this fishnet sleeve, grunge, glitter, button front cardigan 
and has these snaps at the shoulders. Oh my gosh, the stock photo is darling. I have that listed. Designer and Target collabs do pretty good, so I'm always on the lookout. Spe especially, this is new attack. I, did I say that? Or maybe it's not. No, it's not. That's a lie. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is new attack. Yeah, this is new attack. J. Crew. There was so much J. Crew in this haul. You guys, I just kept finding it, and it was new attack, and it was new stuff. What is going on with my camera? J. Crew. This is extra, extra small, but it's definitely oversized. It's a white cotton blouse with these fun little trumpet sleeves and then navy blue bow. And you could t tie them tighter. And that's brand new with tag. And this is free people. This is listed. That's listed too, that J. Crew top is. So you can head on over to my Poshmark closet if you're interested in anything. Uh, this is instantly free people, extra small, way oversized, gray, little floral trapeze tunic. I feel like I've sold that a hundred times. This is the best. Okay, so this is, I thought this was a pajama top, but it's not. It's, it's J. Crew. it's linen, size medium, it's new, it's just from 2021. This is linen, button down top top with the hot pink trim everywhere like at the pockets and everything at the collar so I got that that's listed but it gets better because here is the matching long pencil skirt it's a midi length skirt with the piping best part is this is new with tag this was on clearance for a hundred dollars that's up that's the sale tag size four. Oh my gosh you guys it's linen and i think lyocell it's got these deep pockets oh i was thrilled and then <laughs> i got even excited more excited because i found this j crew new with tag i think this one this one was on sale for eighty dollars this is size six but look at that look at that bow well the three bows and then just the sheer lilac lace Cottage Core Prairie Victorian moment. It has the tank underneath it. Oh my gosh, size six, new with tag. That's listed. That was like a blogger favorite. Um, this new with tag, J. Crew, size two. These pants, you guys, they're like golfer pants. Size two. Look at them. They stretch. They have like a little, like a little bit of gathering right there. Aren't these the cutest little golfer pants you've ever seen? These plaid, baby pink. Oh my gosh. They have pockets. They're so cozy and soft. Like a little golfer pant. Then, J. Crew. Are these new attire? No. But they're like new. These are the, uh, these are called something. The mini, I think. They have bumblebees. Novelty print bumblebees all over them. They're Oh my gosh, how cute. And then I thought, oh, someone could wear these with that white top with the navy blue bows on the sleeves. Precious. Okay, got that. Then I got this Urban Outfitters jumpsuit. I just found the stock photo of this because I already took its pictures. The wide leg jumpsuit. This is size extra. Good grief, I've got the hiccups. Extra small. These are all the things that I photographed today. This is Aparenza. I've never heard of it. It has to be vintage because it has shoulder pads. But I got it based on style. It's just plaid, black and white plaid, one button. So it has shoulder pads. You could take those out. But I thought it's long. It measures like it's like large, extra large. But I thought like on, it could just be worn oversized with jeans and, and like combat boots and a white tee. So cute, one button, very lightweight blazer. This is Spiritual Gangster, size medium, warrior, says warrior. This is a cropped heathered gray hoodie, Spiritual Gangster, and it says Spiritual Gangster on the hood. Yeah, like up here in gold, says it right there in cursive. This hoodie is retails for like 90 bucks, 
and the sold comps are between 40 and 50. This one's really popular. Part of me is like, if I have the cancer, then I'm gonna keep that because I'm a warrior. I don't have results on my biopsy yet. By the time this video goes out, I should have results and you guys should all know. Um, because I'm sure I'll post it somewhere. Good or bad, you'll know. I need help with from you guys. Very important here. Um, is this Vanessa Virginia? What is this label? Is this does anyone recognize this label? Size one, and it's just this woman's face. I got this because it's like a almost like a denim little three button. I thought, oh, this is like dark academia. It's a it's a cute little vibe. I thought this would be cute with like a shirt underneath or like worn open with like a banty under it and some ripped up jeans. This is so cute. And it's like linen and cotton. It's like almost feels like denim, but I don't know who that brand. And I put it into Google Lens and she didn't tell me anything. Not one thing. Do I have time still on here left? Okay. I don't know how much time I have left on this memory card. And then I got this Star Wars. Isn't this the cutest Star Wars sweater? It's like a varsity Star Wars. It has like the shell, like, so it's like fitted. Oh gosh, this is, I don't know. I'm not even like that into Star Wars, but I, I love that. This is new a tag, little Rolling Stone cropped little quarter zip. This is size extra small. No, it's a new tag. This is Urban Outfitters, size medium. This is like a mock neck ribbed turtleneck sweater, and it's like ribbed and very stretchy. But it's like mustard, then lime green and cream. I love the colors of this. Stock photo is super cute. This is Victoria's Secret Gold Label. I almost thought it was going to be country, but it's not. It's medium large, but look at that floral. And it's has this metallic, and it buttons down the front. It's just like a little nighty. Buttons all the way down the front. Oh my gosh, it's stunning. Could be worn as a dress, but it's see-through. You can see through it. All right, now we're moving on. I'm going to give another honorable mention. I got this for two dollars on whatnot, you guys. This is everything granny core dreams are made of. Look at it. It's beaded, embroidered, flowers, dead stock, vintage Liz Claiborne, 100% cotton. Back then it was $84. This is stunning. And I thought, oh my gosh, if someone who's a small and a zero bundled these together. This is like the cutest moment of their life. This is a Madewell size zero. It's the side button midi skirt. So it's mustard color. And it, I got this for like $6 on whatnot. And it buttons down from, from, um, my God, Sydney. The same girl I got the this shirt and the other. I did a bundle because I was just getting the killer deals. Killer deals. I got this skirt. And my daughter, who I got it for, she's like, that's too tight. So, whatever. I'm like, that's fine. I'm going to sell it because it's adorable and someone will buy it with that sweater. Okay, we're almost done. We're almost done. Okay, I got this vintage Tess Studio 100% silk. I mean, I got it. The dark floral, the sheer little ruffle it's got the tank underneath it it's boxy and cropped this is very y2k plus it's silk and i love the dark floral so that's a size 10 petite but it's vintage so it's tiny this is vintage oh my gosh i'm gonna try this on i don't know if i'm gonna sell it this is 100 percent silk size 12 bobby b 100 percent silk look at this dress 100 percent silk is it maxi? Yeah, maxi length. It has these like lagging look, deep pockets off the side, and then it has the belted waist. This little mini belt. Oh my god, isn't this precious? It's a hundred percent silk, Bobby B. I don't know her, but I love her. 
so I'm really excited. I got I found some really great in, um, this is silk in Angora rabbit hair, size medium. Sarah Taylor. She is she was expensive in her day. I mean look at you could see all the Angora. Can you see it? But look at the beading. Have you ever seen anything this exquisite in your entire life? I never have. Look at this. It's like dolman drop sleeves and then it has this ribbed bodice. So it's like a bat wing sleeve. All this beading, hand beaded, and it's angora and silk, this whole thing. Can you believe it? Oh my gosh. And it's gorgeous. I feel like there was one, one flaw somewhere, but I don't even remember where it was. Oh, yes I do. Yes I do. It's this little tiny Do you see it? You see my finger? See it? There's a little tiny hole there, but that's an easy fix, but I can't fix it. I'm not a seamstress. Okay, this is an Old Navy cardigan with the softest rust cardigan you'll ever see in your whole life. It's new with tags. I am not ever, I don't ever stick my nose up to Old Navy new with tag. Their cardigans are so soft. This is like one of those popular ones. Acrylic nylon spandex. Super, super soft. So I got that. This is John Paul Gaultier. Gaultier. John Paul Gaultier for Target. This is cute. This is like a grunge little pinstriped short blazer, like short sleeve blazer longer I mean I just picture someone wearing like jean shorts and fishnet stockings and combat boots with this it has shoulder pads yeah this is a whole moment it's a size large and it's new with tag this was $50 so I'll probably list it at like 40 unless like it did it, unless it's like sold out and did really well then I'll look up comps and see this is JOH is this a good brand I'm not really sure you guys I, I hope you're here to help me because <laughs> this is like a just a marble effect tie-dye looking I think it's silk there had to be a reason I got this it's rayon 100% rayon j-o-h that sounds so familiar is that good it's an extra large super super soft I've got to have a sip Okay, if you're still here, let me know. I want to know in the comments. This is Fashion Nova Come Alive Jacket Size Small. I only got this because it's trendy. It probably was only a couple dollars. It's like completely see-through. It has this big giant kangaroo pocket in the front. It's flappy. I already found the stock photo for Come Alive Jackets. New tag. I mean, but the, but the comps on these jackets are $20. Like, solid $20. I've seen some sell for $25. And it's just Fashion Nova, so some of that stuff from that website does pretty good. This is BB Dakota, size small. It is definitely not the season, but I could not leave it. It's like a wool. This is a winter coat. And it's just beautiful. I love the colors. Honestly, I was being kind of selfish and thinking about myself for the fall. It's like long you know to the knee has these great pockets it's got a hood and it has these it has the cinching like in the inside where you can like make your you know to make it flattering I just love this coat so I don't know if I'm gonna sell it or keep it I also have some of its wool in my mouth okay anyways this is made well it's got stars it's one of the flannels but it's the constellation one I'm really excited to see what this one goes for. It's so, so soft. It's a, it's the classic. Um, it has like the contrast pinstripe in the inside. It's extra, extra small, but it is definitely oversized. It's so soft. These are the things I haven't taken pictures of yet. This is J. Crew size large, the perfect Christmas dress. I'm so thrilled. <laughs> These big balloon sleeves, smocked at the waist, size large. It's sheer and it has the, I don't know if you can see the dress. 
see the navy dress inside and it's ruffled at the bottom absolutely we absolutely got that little Christmas dress I got hair in my mouth I got it don't worry this is Bryn Walker I don't find this brand very often this is size large this has a name I have it listed I think I have it listed for like 50 I think this is a lagging look linen oversize wide lagging look linen blouse top it's called something I can't remember the name of it sorry guys you're like we're never coming back to this channel you can't remember anything I'm sorry I'm really sorry um, urban outfitter size small this is a chunky chenille like oversized dolman sleeve Ugh, the softest coziest green green little cardigan you'll ever ever see size small urban outfitters definitely oversized though I think the measurements were like 22 across so okay this is J crew size small says bliss it's just a sweater but I'm pretty sure it was like wool and something and it's a collab wool alpaca yeah 21% alpaca and it's embroidered it says bliss and yeah Na it's navy blue oh here's another J Crew. it's new and tags size 4 new and tag I don't know who donated all their J Crew stuff to that to that place that day but I about died I was you know me guys I love J Crew. <laughs> And I'm like, oh my gosh, all these are like 2021. Like, they're all recent. Anyways, this is like a tweed. has zipper cups. It zips up. It's a little crop blazer jacket. So cute. Very nautical. I have that listed. Okay, is this it? This is the last one? Last one. Talbot's size 2. And this is like a rainbow striped. It's brand new with tag. Same place I found all the J Crew. It's like a rainbow striped little cropped blazer jacket. It's lined with bright orange in the inside. And this is also listed. This was perfect. It's like a summer popsicle. It's perfect for the summer. It's been listed since, I don't know, a couple weeks after my birthday. All the new with tag stuff I got listed right away, but it hasn't sold yet. Some people have better luck with Talbots than I do. I'm not mad at them. I wish everyone nothing but success in whatever they sell and wherever they sell. So, Anyways, that is all. Holy cow, that was a long one. Was it long? Oh, not that bad. 35 minutes. Wow, I did that fast. Whew. Okay, that's it. So I'm all cut up. I've, I have filmed all my haul videos. I don't know when you'll be seeing this, but there's more coming. Don't you worry. <laughs> okay, I love you guys so much. Thanks for all the support. Thanks for everything. Be sure you're subscribed. And yeah, let me know what you're up to down in the comments. I love talking to you guys. Okay, I'll see you in my next one. Bye!